Hi everyone. I thought I'd share my attempt at emulating the synth bass sound in Michael Jackson's Thriller using the Roland GR55 guitar synthesizer and my Ibanez bass, which I just equipped with a Roland GK3B bass pickup. First of all, the pickup and controller installation on my bass is not ideal from a playability standpoint due to the shape and layout of my bass. I've tried mounting it in various locations, and where I have it now seems to be kind of the best compromise. One of the annoying things about the controller, the way Roland designed it, is the volume knob is super loose and really easy to bump when playing, which results can result in some unintended consequences. Um, anyway, to remedy that, I pulled the knob off the shaft and added an O-ring around the shaft and then put some foam into the inside knob cavity, and that really seem to tighten it up pretty good, so accidental volume changes are not much of an issue anymore for me. The other problem is the S1 and S2 switches are also pretty easy to bump, but so far by being kind of careful when I'm playing, I've been able to avoid hitting them. However, I'd like to make it a little more foolproof in the future, so if you have any ideas, please let me know. This next image is um, the main page in the GR55 floorboard editor, which is, by the way, courtesy of Gumtown on vguitarforums.com. Highly recommend you get that. And as it shows for the Thriller patch, I'm using two PCM synth sounds, uh, which would be number 241, the synth bass number 2, and number um, 218, the fretless bass, as well as an electric Cosm bass model and a little bit of my normal pickups blended in. I found that um, having the electric bass blended in added a little bit more definition, which I thought was needed for the staccato parts in Thriller. Okay, and um, the next image um, is for the PCM synth number one, and it just shows you the details for that tone. I'm pretty sure that a mini Moog was used in Jackson's recording. Um, and there's a PCM tone in the GR55 called Big Mini that I thought might be um, a Moog like, a mini Moog like tone. Um, but when I used it, it just it didn't sound right. So I kept auditioning more PCM tones and finally settled on number 241. And this image is for PCM synth number two. And it just shows you the details for that tone, which, as I mentioned, is a number 218, the fretless bass number one. I thought this, um, this tone gave the sound a little bit more edge. Okay, and this page is the, um, the image of the screen for the electric bass Cosm model, um, which in this case is number four. The Fender Precision Bass. Um, and as you can see, I've got the volume and tone up at 100%. And finally, this last screen is just for the amp model that I chose. It's a uh, clean bass amp with a medium gain. And um, after this is a short little sample of how the GR55 Thriller bass patch sounds. Thanks for listening. <laughs> Thank you.